terrorism with one hand, while with the other hand we are funding terrorism, arming terrorism, and training terrorism. So, this began, in case you haven't heard, but you can look it up anywhere on the internet, even on Wikipedia, where did this terrorist thing get started? In Afghanistan, that's right, Charlie Wilson, in Afghanistan, to fight against the Soviet Union, we created the International Jihadi Movement, and boy, did it backfire. So we said, let's put it to bed. We started this monster. We can put an end to it by depriving it of its food, of its funding, and its weapons. Dropping more bombs and bullets Shooting up terrorism only creates the next cycle of terrorism. We need to be on that debate stage. What do you do? Please go to my website, jill2016.com, so we can continue to work together. Miracle of miracles, if only Bernie could somehow capture that nomination. Our hearts are with him, our hearts are with you. Whatever happens, you know, my campaign is here. We are going to continue this movement. It's not going away. After these email revelations of the backstabbing and the sabotage by the DNC, by Hillary's campaign, and the collusion of the corporate media, we cannot leave it in their hands. Because it's hard to have a revolutionary campaign inside of a counter-revolutionary political party. I want to leave you with one more thing. When you look out over what we can do, the political predators tell us, oh, the problems are much too complicated. We could never solve them. We can't both have an economy and jobs and save the planet. You know, that's absolutely false. We cannot have an economy unless we save the planet. The same is true for every crisis in front of us. How do we put an end to police violence? We change the culture of policing. We demilitarize the police. We create civilian review boards. We have the power of the subpoena. It's a higher and higher. And we create a national commission on truth and reconciliation so we can get down to the bottom of this problem, the crisis of racism that has not gone away since the criminal institution of slavery. is by 
like our promise as our first act when we turn the White House into a greenhouse. The very first thing that I will do if I have the honor to serve is to do for a generation of young people what the political puppets and profiteers already did for the crooks on Wall Street. We need to bail out the students holding predatory student loan debt. We do away with that debt. And we make public higher education free, along with health care, along with a welcoming path to citizenship. Over.